I'm at the yard of Sharon Cotson and a big thanks to her for the comments for her runners on Tuesday. She starts in race one with the two runners and first up is Elusive Marta. Now Elusive Marta is course and distance suited, says Sharon, and uh, she does have a neat draw. So she's really got no excuses. A big run is expected and Sharon says she will be disappointed if she misses the money. She'll be joined by Alta Laka. It will be her third start for the yard and although probably still a little bit short for her, Sharon is hoping for improvement and she's hoping that she starts to get to act together. In race two, Home Reef, joining me in pick, um, will be stepping out and he ran a really good race on local day before the yard. Sharon says, really hoping that he can follow up and another good run is expected. Moving to race three, the beautiful grey, amazing colours. She's nicely in at the weight, says Sharon, and also has a neat draw, so hoping that she can start bouncing back to herself. Island Master runs in race four, and he's done absolutely nothing wrong of recent. He's got the draw, he enjoys track and trip, and Sharon is expecting another good run. Pay and Art will see him in action in race six. Uh, he has a good draw, enjoys the poly and the 2,200 meter trip. He's ultra consistent and always gives of his best, so another nice run should be on the cards. Two runners in race seven. Graduation time is course and distance suited. He had a bit of a break after his last, Sharon said, so hoping that he doesn't just need this, but he should put a better effort in. <laughs> Sweet and true will join him, and he had a brilliant win in his last. This will be his first run out of the maidens, and he does take on older. So Sharon said, we'll learn a little bit more about where he's at at the moment, and will be interesting to see. Finishing in race eight, Iron Tail and War Launch. Iron Tail definitely enjoys course and distance. He's a super strong soldier, says Sharon, really expecting a good run from him. He'll be joined by War Launch, who Sharon says has got the perfect draw. Marco is up, and Marco really seems to have got a song out of him last time out, so Sharon is hoping that he can reproduce the good improvement he showed in that last start.